Aaron, two straight games with two RBIs for Ben Benintendi. What does it mean to the lineup to have him so productive? Yeah, he's, I mean, kind of been talking about it the whole time with him. You know, he's such a good hitter, such a good bat to ball, controls the strike zone, um, and, and it feels like he's really starting to settle in now. And, uh, you know, he's come up big for us last couple of days, obviously, but, but feel like for the better part of the last week, he's, he's starting to build that momentum. Anthony on the left. Aaron, is, is Herman's personality where when he's faced with facing Scherzer that he's going to be motivated by that or say, I don't care who's the other guy on the mound, I'm just going to play my game? I mean, look, I, th I think he loved being in this environment. You could feel that energy out there. You know, I think I think he liked that. But, you know, part of being a really good big leaguer is you got to be able to match that energy all the time. You know, I think – more than anything, he's finding a good rhythm here these last several starts and, you know, starting to build, you know, it was a late start for him to the season, you know, so he's getting into the, you know, meat of his season now where he's racked up some outings, he's got some experience, he's got some rhythm going and, um, and you know, it shouldn't be that big a surprise. He's always, he's been a really good pitcher for us and he's throwing the ball that way right now. Lindsay, Aaron, what what happened with the dead ball play with Rizzo in the first inning? Um, so Scherzer just grabbed the ball and they didn't put the ball back in play. So they didn't. It, it was the the umpires' time had been called and they hadn't put the ball back in play. He just had a ball went up there and stepped off. So yeah. We'll go to Brendan and then John. Before the game, you talked about how the wise guys seemed like he was getting closer to what he was in uh, 2021. Is that what you saw tonight? And also, what did you see tonight from him? Yeah, I mean, that's, you know, that's a obviously a really good team in a, in a big-time environment. And for him to come in and throw the ball like that, that's what he's capable of. And that's what we're working to get him to. So encouraging to see him go out in the, you know, biggest spot um, in this game and, and just – you know, really execute, you know, you saw it right away, he came in, we faced Marte right off the bat, and you saw that boring in sinker on him and kind of that half swing, and, and then he was he was really aggressive with his stuff, and when he's got that arm side sinker going, then he can work his change up and breaking ball off of that. He's really tough. So uh, another, yeah, another hopefully really good step for Lowe. Back right side of the room, John. Yeah, uh, the team's fall was... Um, the what? The team's fall was pretty shocking after the incredible start. Um, now you've won two games in a row against uh, your main rivals, in, so to speak, and great pitchers, I know, one going to the Hall of Fame. Do you feel like you're coming out of it, you're out of it, and you're back, or where do you feel like you stand? Look, we're head down right now. You know, we're, we're at a challenging point of our season. You know, we've, we've had some attrition. We've had some guys, we're dinged up a little bit. Um, you know, obviously the last couple of weeks have been a little bit of a struggle for us offensively. Um, you know, in the last two games, I thought, you know, with the exception of of, of the pop up, we've done a lot of really really good things. You know, from from some really important bullpen guys stepping up for us. You know, Nestor yesterday with his start, Domingo today with his start. I feel like a lot of really good defensive plays, some key clutch at bats. Um, you know, we hit the ball out of the ballpark today, so that was good. Uh, hit the ball out of the ballpark yesterday with Benny in in a tie game. So, you know, I, it's it's good to get a couple of wins against a r really good opponents and and good pitchers. But you know, it's it's kind of now on to the next one and keep our head down and keep kind of digging ourselves out and get ourselves back to playing that really consistent brand of ball in, in all phases. Left side of the room, Marley. Aaron, can you tell us what you believe happened in that Cabrera Gonzalez play? The, you were what? The Cabrera Gonzalez, almost the closure. Yeah, just a yeah. communication error. Yeah. Next one to Bob. Far Aaron, right. I was just following up on John's question. Um, do you think tonight, though, against Scherzer, against a very good team, as you said, biggest crowd of the year, did you guys made a statement tonight? No. No? No statement? I mean, the statement will be made if we're standing at the end. Mm -hmm. That's that's where the statements come. You know, we're 
we know what we know what we're capable of. We think we're capable of being the best team in the world. That's what we're working to get to. Um, like I said, we we're a little banged up right now. Um, Look, what we've been through here these last couple of weeks, it's definitely encouraging and exciting to play really good against two really good opponents when they got great pitchers on the mound. But, you know, it's we got a long ways to go in this thing and we got to we got to play this brand if we play this brand of baseball, we'll be in good shape. I mean, that's I know that. Um and that's what we're working to do. Ron for a fan base that's clearly anxious and always hypercritical, how many consecutive Chris games does it take to alleviate all that sort of panic out in the airway? Four and a half. No. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, look, we've the, the one thing I think we've done pretty well all year is <clears throat> we've caught the ball well. And... You know, even through these struggles, and even though you're going to make an error or make a mistake every now and then, um, I feel like that's continued. Um, we are a much better defensive team, and I think we have a chance to even get better as we get some more guys into the mix that we think have a chance to impact us and, and come back when with injuries and stuff. So, um, I don't know. I don't, and we really don't get caught up in that. Again, we at our core, I think we believe we're a really good team, and. Um, that's what we're working hard every day to go out and prove. And how many that is in a row that we got to show that, I'll leave that up to you guys. You know, we're we're working to be the best we can be.